On today's menu, the Trinidad Maruga Scorpion Pepper. <sighs> Holy sh! Across the globe, what's delicious is questionable. Why would you eat that? With special guest eater, Brendan from The Knock. So we've already recorded the narration for this week's episode, uh, but we thought it might be funny if I ate a scorpion pepper and tried to redo the narration in, well, in real time. Uh, Good luck. So here goes. The title of world's hottest chili pepper has been hotly contested for some years now. You see what I did there? But the reigning champion is the Maruga scorpion pepper, native to Trinidad, Tobago, and, well, hell. The, <coughs> the South American nation of Trinidad and Tobago is a region from where all of the world's hottest chili peppers originated. Over the course of hundreds of years, these varieties have spread to other countries and continents. These, these peppers evolved over time to have extreme heat as a tactic to discourage mammals from eating the pepper and thus destroying the seeds in their digestive tract. The heat or spice or atomic fire is caused by chemical components within the pepper called capsaicinoids. The chief of these Capsaicin is measured to determine a pepper's ranking on the Scoville scale. <coughs> oh, oh, God. The Scoville organoleptic test, as it's officially known, was created by pharmaceutical chemist Wilbur Scoville in 1912 to quantify the relative heat of chili peppers. And who tells us what the, the relative heat of the pepper is? Well, these days, it's researchers at New Mexico State University's Chili Pepper Institute who don full body suits, gas masks, goggles, and two pairs of latex gloves to handle the pepper samples. Ever the overachiever, the Maruga scorpion pepper ate through both layers of latex, reaching the researcher's skin. The higher the number of SHU, the hotter the chili pepper. Bell peppers, they rank a zero, no heat. Jalapenos are around 3,000 to 8,000 on the Scoville scale. The former hottest pepper in the world, the boot Jalokia, or the ghost chili. Well, she's a mean bitch clocking in somewhere around a million SHU. But the Maruga Scorpion, which is 1,000 times hotter than a typical bottle of hot sauce, and at least twice as hot as Sofia Vergara, can hit... <coughs> can hit can hit SHU levels of over 2 million or roughly the same as law enforcement grade pepper spray. You alright? I gotta eat some yogurt, man. Do you, do you want to give our Twitter handles? Mm. Oh, f oh. Oh. So why would you eat that? Well, that's the question. Those who enjoy extreme spice rave about the pepper's amazing fruit-like flavor, which I didn't get any of. Uh, <laughs> um, while culinary thrill-seekers eat whole peppers at a time and suffer a consequence, extreme eaters also get a narcotic-like endorphin rush from eating super spicy peppers after the burning has stopped. <sighs> Sounds delish. Let's kill the office. Oh, f You like spicy food? This shit's hot! Hotter than hot! You like spicy food? It's hotter than Tatooine! Tucson, son! You like spicy food? It's 
hotter than two girls making out in a warehouse fire! Stop kissing and get out! Hey, you wanna eat something spicy? It's hotter than Magic Mike! What? I'm talking box office heat. Domestic Rose? Oh! 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 Then you should probably come with me. Alright, I gotta say I'm a little bit nervous about this one. Should I swallow it really fast and not really chew it? I don't wanna touch it with anything that would have taste buds. <laughs> Swallowed it. I got it. I got it. I got a whole seed pod. I feel like it's starting. <laughs> oh my god! It's going up to my eyes. <laughs> Holy sh! <laughs> no, it's, it's fine. It's totally fine. I... <laughs> it helps if you breathe out. All I can do is breathe out. Did you just breathe out the whole time? That's all you can do is breathe out. Oh my god, it's so bad. It's so awful. This is a big deal. It's really painful. <laughs> oh, just, it's like an argument with your ex-girlfriend. It just flares up. It just keeps happening. You just want it to stop and it won't stop. I never ate anything that made me made me shake before. I'll definitely flash back to that when I'm on my deathbed. Mm-hmm. Then Mackenzie started bragging. Wait a minute. This is really not a competition. I've definitely won. 100% I've won. She was talking a lot of game out there. Uh, it wasn't that bad. I want to have another one. Get her, get her to, get Mackenzie to get Mackenzie. Another one. That's what I'm gonna do. Just for Mackenzie. And I'm adding the rest of mine. Right I made a super pepper. With another pepper. If she gets this pepper, it's going to destroy her. There's a question of whether or not I got a dud pepper. I'm going for the record, number two. Why am I doing this to myself again? Uh, Okay, I'm totally fine. Breathe I don't know what house. you're talking about. Mm -hmm. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm totally fine. Totally fine. No, what did I do? How did that happen? I don't know. I was totally fine two seconds ago. This is so bad. This is so bad. <laughs> it's in my throat. <laughs> no. Ah, I feel like that's the problem. Two pepper combination. Ow, my ears. No, no, your mouth is wrong. It was three peppers. What? There's a pepper inside of a pepper. F <laughs> <laughs> what? Pepper prank. <laughs> what? Did you hear what they did? What they do? They hid. They snuck <laughs> a half of a pepper inside of another pepper and said, "Hey, Mackenzie, why don't you try again? Because you were such a champ the last time. Let's just go ahead and do it again." And I'm like, "Great, totally. I'm really cool." Like, you wanted to win. <laughs> That's a record. You ate three of the hottest peppers in the world. Ow. But this lunatic is about to eat four. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Brendan from The Knock, and I asked them who ate the most, and somebody ate three yesterday, so I'm just going to eat four. And it's stupid, and it's going to be a problem. It's starting to get hot. Oh. <sighs> I put the first one in and I was like, oh, this is fine. I'm the champion of this. <laughs> and can I have some yogurt? Yeah. Yeah, man. <laughs> it's the worst thing of my life. The worst thing that's ever happened to me. Holy shit. Oh, that's terrible. So bad. It hurts so bad. I'm just angry. I have a lot of anger bubbling up right now. I have a lot of hatred that I didn't know existed inside of me. I'm mad at my mom. 
I don't know why. Yeah, I just ate four peppers. What? Yeah, it was a huge mistake. Are you the one who ate three? Yeah, why would you do that to me? Did you do three in a row? I did four all in my mouth, chewed it all up. That was an idiot. Yeah, I wish you were here 20 minutes ago, McKenzie, because this is the worst time of my life. Oh, you threw up last night? Maybe I should Google if four pepper, four of these peppers can kill you. And I, I, that's what I decided to Google after, after I didn't think, you know, a lot of things that I do for videos and stuff. I'm like, oh, that sucked, but it was worth it. And this, no, not worth it. Four peppers. I know what you're thinking. He should be dead. Well, according to estimates by the current director of the New Mexican Chili Institute, it would take 2.8 pounds of these peppers to kill you. So the more you know. So click subscribe, come back next week, share it with your friends. We love you guys. You're our raison d'etre. It's our party and we'll blow this up if we want to. Well, we actually did. Today's Why Would You Eat That menu features fried bull testicles. Watch what happens when we feed it to the office. Taste America's most expensive beer. Split an apple with your bare hands. Lose weight drinking Pepsi. Tune into the food feeder for all the news that's not fit to print. Watch Dinosaur Barbecue Pitmaster John Stage on Dude Food for his easy-to-follow shrimp recipe with the New Orleans Swiss. The magic ingredient? Beer. Check out star chef Ilan Hall's Seven Secrets for an Unforgettable Burger. Oh, you're welcome. Why would you eat natto, also known as rancid, stinky soybeans? Well, you wouldn't, but you can watch us hold our noses while we try to keep it down. Subscribe for free for more tasted treats.